In a stunning turn of events, the long-standing mystery surrounding the tragic 1996 murder of iconic rapper Tupac Shakur has taken a dramatic twist. Dwayne Keefe D. Davis, a man who has been publicly boasting about his involvement in Tupac's death for years, has finally been arrested. But this arrest may just be the beginning of a much larger story, as Keefe has previously implicated none other than Sean Diddy Combs as the mastermind behind the murder plot. According to Keefe's startling confession, Diddy allegedly orchestrated the entire operation and paid him a staggering $1 million to eliminate both Tupac and Death Row Records CEO. Suge Knight. Recent reports suggest that Keefe might be considering cooperating with law enforcement, which has sent shockwaves through Diddy's camp. It appears that the once-rumored connections Diddy had within law enforcement may no longer provide him protection. Could this shocking development lead to Diddy's downfall as well? The situation is rapidly evolving, and the truth behind Tupac's murder may finally be coming to light. Dwayne Keefe Davis now 60 years old, was apprehended near his residence on the outskirts of Las Vegas. He faces charges of murder with a deadly weapon, as well as a sentencing enhancement related to gang activity. If convicted, this enhancement could add an additional 20 years to his sentence. It's essential to note that while Keefe wasn't the one who pulled the trigger, Nevada law allows individuals to be charged if they played a role in the commission of a crime. Authorities executed a search at Keefe's residence and seized various electronic devices, including hard drives, tablets, laptops, and documents related to Tupac's case. Among the seized items were a copy of Vibe magazine featuring Tupac and a book titled Compton Street Legend, which Keefe had co-authored. Keefe's connection to Tupac's murder first garnered attention through his appearances, in the Netflix documentary series Unsolved and the subsequent release of his book Compton Street Legend. In both the documentary and the book, Keefe hinted at his presence inside the car during Tupac's murder. During initial investigations, Keefe had been cleared of all charges and denied any involvement. However, in interviews, he began making cryptic statements about the events surrounding the murder. In a July 2019 interview on Vlad TV, he acknowledged his presence in the white Cadillac on the night of the incident, but refused to disclose the identities of others in the car. He did confirm that the shooter was Orlando Anderson, his nephew. Perhaps the most shocking aspect of Keefe's allegations is his claim that Diddy offered a substantial $1 million to the Southside Crips to eliminate Tupac and Suji Knight. Former lapsed detective Greg Kading, who worked on both Tupac and Biggie Smalls cases, has publicly stated that investigators possessed evidence of Diddy's alleged payment to Keefe. A recording of Keefe confessing to this was reportedly in the investigator's possession for years. While it may seem unbelievable that such a high-profile figure as Diddy could be implicated in Tupac's murder, Keefe's arrest has led to speculation that authorities may have discovered a paper trail connecting Diddy to the million-dollar offer. Remarkably, Diddy has not directly addressed Keefe's allegations. When asked about them during an interview on The Breakfast Club, Diddy declined to entertain the notion, dismissing it as nonsense. However, some observers have noted a change in Diddy's demeanor and actions in recent months, including him reportedly returning publishing rights to former bad boy artists and having them sign Andias for their masters. As this story continues to unfold, it raises questions about whether Diddy could potentially face legal consequences in connection with Tupac's murder. The internet is abuzz with speculation, with some eagerly anticipating the possibility of Diddy's indictment, while others remain skeptical, citing the lack of concrete evidence. The arrest of Keefe D has opened a new chapter in the ongoing saga of Tupac's murder. The true motives behind the crime and the extent of any high-level involvement are still shrouded in mystery. As Keefe's trial progresses, we can expect more revelations and developments that could potentially reshape the narrative surrounding one of hip-hop's most significant tragedies. We will keep you updated on this intriguing case. In the meantime, share your thoughts. Do you believe that Diddy could genuinely be implicated in Tupac's murder? Leave your comments below and stay tuned for further updates on this gripping story.